Last time on Untold Stories Bite Size, we took a look at the story of Hellfire Corner, a local legend here in West Yorkshire. While writing that episode, I remembered another local tale I'd discovered when researching other West Yorkshire myths and folklore. So for this episode, I thought I'd do something a little different and actually visit the site of this very local legend. So join me here at Thornton Viaduct to hear the tale of Fair Becker. I said in the introduction that this story was local, but pinning down the exact spot where it took place has been a bit of a challenge, a few different places taking credit for its origin. The most common location seems to be here on Thornton Viaduct, although confusingly, some local historians date the tale to a few years before the viaduct was even constructed. The story is most often told, goes that the son of a wealthy mill owner from Denholm fell in love with a local farm girl by the name of Rebecca. The pair would meet at Hugh Clue's farm in secret and take long rides together. The young man eventually plucked up the courage to tell his family about this, as they saw it, commoner, and that he wished to marry her, insisting he loved her deeply. As expected, his family forbade the marriage, telling the heartbroken young man that he was already promised to a girl from another wealthy family, and that he cannot, in any circumstances, be seen with this farm girl. The young man, realising that he would never be allowed to be with Rebecca, decided that if he would never be with her, no one else would. The next day, the couple met for one of their secret rides along Thornton Viaduct when the young man realised what must be done. Riding side by side with Becca, the young man leant over and pushed the young girl from her saddle, causing her to hit the wall and plummet to her death in the valley below. Of course, the death was covered up as an accident by the young man's family and Rebecca was buried at the Old Bell Chapel in Thornton. Some versions of the story also have the young man losing his grasp on sanity due to guilt before ending his days in an asylum in Menston, holding his head in his hands, weeping. The original story seems to have its origins in the late 1800s and was written about by local Bradford historian William Cudworth in 1886. This version of the story is slightly different and has the young man killing Becca by throwing her from her horse into a disused pit near old Alan Moore, where the corpse of Rebecca was found, fearfully mangled, at the bottom of the pit. It's never really been made clear when and how Thornton Viaduct was inserted into the tale, but regardless of its inclusion, local people have for the last 150 years or so, claimed to see the ghost of the tragic fair Becker wandering along the viaduct, looking for the man she once loved, or at the very least, someone to replace him. With its elements of love outside of class status and lonely spirits searching for a lost love, the story certainly has the feel of Wuthering Heights and other Bronte sisters tales. Very fitting for this area of West Yorkshire, a pretty good analogy of the local landscape. Striking beauty within an oppressive bleakness, breathtaking landscape full of tales of sadness and war. I'm looking forward to telling you a few more of these tales and hopefully visiting some more of these sites in the future. So if you decide to come for a walk here at Thornton Viaduct, just be careful. Becca might be lonely and a uh, bit of a long drop down. Till next time. Thanks for checking out this episode of Untold Stories Bite Size. We'd really appreciate it if you subscribed and liked and shared and all that good stuff. And you can find us on all of the social media if you want to come over and say hello or maybe have your own suggestions of what we can cover in a future episode. See you next time.